Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a little bit of serious business, so I figured, um, I promised my new friend Josie, whose URL my favorite blog to go to right at this point, can be found right here, and her latest YouTube video is right there, you should subscribe to her, she's pretty cool. Um, I promised I'd draw her a penguin and a llama, so that's what I'm going to do. Her, I draw her a penguin and a llama. And I think they came out okay. The llama kind of irritates me, but it's gonna grow on me. And the penguin, I like the penguin. So to Josie, you're so cool. And there we go. On to serious stuff. Uh, if you couldn't tell by the title of the video, you might be blind. You might want to go to the eye doctor or something. But today's video is about anxiety and depression. And I figured. Before we get into all the technical, emotional nonsense, we define them all. Anxiety is a feeling of worry, nervousness, or unease. Um, I guess that, that's about right. Uh, depression, the, I have the um, description I got off Google, is a condition of mental disturbance uh, typically with lack of energy, difficulty in maintaining concentration, and interest in life. Um, I guess it might have meant uh, no interest in life, I don't know. Um, I guess that works. I'd say I'd describe it more as a spiraling whirlpool of sadness and self-hate that just drags you down farther than where you want to go. Uh, I found that depression and anxiety are linked. Um, well for me they are because when I start having a social breakdown I pretty much start saying oh my god everyone hates me and then I just go into everything that's wrong and I'm like, I don't like the way this is, I need to change this, I'm such an awful person. And they're just kind of linked for me. I'm not sure about everyone else because I know some of the most friendliest people in the world who have like a bazillion friends are actually really depressed and it's kind of sad. Um, one of my friends on Tumblr actually um, committed suicide and uh, no one really knew about it until it was too late. So... I don't want that to happen to anyone else. With depression, it's kind of like you can't sleep, you can't eat, and all you want to do is just stop this horrible feeling and the feeling won't go away. And, and the only way to feel like you're alive is to hurt yourself. And that's not a good feeling. And, and trust me, I know what you're going through. It's like a constant cycle of sorrow and self-hate, only to have a breakdown that you'll tell no one about and you realize that it's just too much to handle but you don't want to tell anyone because it's a constant fear that a you'll hurt yourself or you'll hurt others or it, your family already thinks you're crazy enough what if they medicate you what if they lock you away this is just too much on top of everything why won't it stop is that just me Oh yeah, feeling cool. Hey, that's a cute shirt. Thanks. Ugh, I'm not handing the paper to her. Oh god, what an interesting shirt. You make that yourself? <laughs> so yeah, that's the story of this shirt. No joke, my algebra class is a social anxiety nightmare. If the work wasn't hard enough, it's the people that's in that class. I'm just surrounded by egotistical, judgmental, intimidating brats all the time. And there's this one kid who I sit next to who I happen to have known forever, but we don't really talk that much anymore. But yes, lots of fun that math class. Yeah, you can see why I'm totally comfortable in that class all the time, right? Yeah, yeah. So today's video question is, do you have anxiety? If you do, wh what do you do to make sure you don't have an attack? Uh, just leave a comment down there and I'll read them. 
So this week's movie of the week is Breakfast Club, and I give it a 10 out of 10. Would watch any time. We were watching it in my health class because we're doing stereotypes, and I just really enjoyed that movie. It was a great movie, and 1010 would watch any time, all the time. So uh, that's it for today. Um, I, we're going to end on a happy note, so yay, happy disposition. Um, yeah, so leave a comment, uh, please subscribe, and like. Hey, thanks.